And I decided to make two things. I've got a, an acai bowl, acai bowl, and a black bean Brazilian stew. Fair order. All righty. So I'm going to get started quickly. All right. So my pot is nice and hot. And I'm just putting a, a dazzle of like olive oil. You know, usually when we do rice and beans, we usually use like lots of coriander and things like that, cilantro. But this one is a little different where you're going to be using some spices and it's really good. So I'm going to just put my onions in there. I'm going to use like just one small medium onion. I think this is a bit of a, I use two because I did a one before and it was a bit large. And then I'm going to, it did say carrots and I actually forgot the carrots. And also we have sweet potato. Now my sweet potato, I kind of like did them like, Kind of pre boiled it a little bit just a tiny bit, so I'm putting that towards the end. I'm putting a little bit of garlic, all right, and then I'm going to go to my spices. We have a bay leaf, let's go in. There were two cloves of the garlic. We have a half a tablespoon of smoked paprika. Then we have a uh, half a teaspoon of dried oregano leaves. Dried oregano leaves is really good on like fresh tomatoes as well. There's a little bit of olive oil, salt and pepper if you ever want a snack. And then we have one tablespoon of red wine and vinegar. Right, we're going to do this. Let's mix that up. So you're getting all the aroma from the spices right there. Then we're going to add our sweet potato now. And then our black beans, our rinsed black beans. Put them in there. Not so good. Touch of salt and pepper. And then you can either use vegetable broth or chicken broth and just put it in there and then let them let it cook. Okay. So I'll turn that down. Let that cook. We've got like a nice little bit of juice in there. Let the beans cook, and then that is that. You're gonna let it cook, and I'll show you the results after. All right, moving on to an acai bowl. I made one earlier this morning, so you could see at the end. So this is acai. This was actually started in Brazil. You know, it's so common now, and a lot of the young kids are eating acai bowls, which is amazing. But they're really expensive. They're like twelve dollars. All right, they do sell this in Trader Joe's. They have it on Amazon Fresh, a couple of places. All right, this is a side. It's supposed to be like a super fruit. Okay, and it's un unsweetened. Look at it. Here's the pack. This is what the pack looks like. All right, and now I'm just going to show you how to make it. And you can put lots of fruits. Like I've got loads of different colored fruits, and I made a homemade granola. So this is the inside. We're going to put frozen banana in this just to give it that like nice sort of like whipped thing. And this is my banana. I use a frozen banana, so it's a little stiff. When your bananas are over ripening, don't waste them. Put them in the freezer. You can always make a smoothie and like that with it. Also, it's asking for a little liquid. I'm gonna just put a touch of coconut water in there. You can use a pineapple juice and apple juice. I'm just using coconut water because that's what I have on hand. Then I'm gonna blend it. I'm gonna take it out. We're gonna get the aside. It's like a smoothie consistency, which is really nice. And then 
we are going to dress it up with like lots of different fruits and stuff and so on. So we can put some strawberries, some blackberries. Have some fresh mangoes. I saw all these beautiful fruits and I kind of went crazy. Kiwis. Have some fresh granola. I'll make granola. And then some blueberries. It's like such a lot of oh, I can put two more strawberries here. There you go. So that's one that I've just done quickly, but I do have everything ready. We're going to walk over to my stuff. Okay, so here is your Brazilian rice and beans bowl. It's whole grain rice, complex carb. We spoke about it, and it's also portion controlled. The white beans are really, really good for you, a good protein. We have our acai bowl, and my water of the week this week is mango, blueberry, and mint. And